What's going on my friends and today we're going to be doing a differential oil change on this Teraflex 44 but it's going to be the same principle if you have a Dana 44, Teraflex 44 or any other 44 axle so stay tuned for this video and the tools that we're going to be using are a 3A Allen key and a 13 inch socket so that's the only thing you are going to need so the first step will be to drain the differential oil and you're going to have a plug back here I don't know if you can see it or not this plug it doesn't matter if you have a Dana 44 or any 44 axle it's going to be back there so let's do it And just by seeing the quality of this oil is pretty, pretty bad, pretty dark. And now after you're done with the oil, you can now remove all the bolts. And again, we're going to be using a 13 millimeters socket. So let's do this guys. It's pretty easy guys, come on, you know how to do this. So now all the bolts are removed from the diff cover. Now it's time to, to remove the diff cover. So let's do that. So it's going to be a little stuck here because um, we have RTV gasket maker. Uh, so the best thing I recommend is to remove one of these plug and then use it as, a, as an anchor. So let's do that. So now that the diff cover is off, we can now clean it and we're going to be using brake cleaner to clean these gears up so let's do that guys So just let it dry after you clean it and it's going to dry really, really fast as you can see now here. And now we're going to be using some Motul gear oil and the gasket is going to be from Loop Locker, but don't worry guys, I will leave you the link to all of these products in the description below. So it's really easy. And this is how the gasket looks. It's really easy guys no brainer so you put it here and you know how it goes so we're going to put it here first and then I'm sorry guys I'm using only one hand to do all of this so so after you're done uh, just Put the deep cover back and it's really easy guys. And before you put the oil, don't forget about the drain plug. Just put it back. And now it's time to remove those these two um bolts and put the deep oil. So Let's do that guys. So I already removed the first one and now I'm removing the second one. And maybe you guys can tell me why did Teraflex put two of these um, these nuts here on this diff. Um, I'm not an expert but if you only put one like a Dana 60 or Dana 44. I think that will be amazing but maybe you guys can tell me why they have two holes like I said I'm going to be using Motul and the reason I like Motul 
is because you have this. So it makes it really, really easy to, to put the gear oil on the diff coat, on the differential. So now let's put it on using only one hand, so I don't know how to do it with one hand. Really simple guys. And you will know when it is full because it's going to start leaking. You can see it is now leaking, so it mean it means it is full. So let's put the diff first plug in. And now we have to do the same thing with the second one. So let's do it with the second one. So after two bottles and just a little bit, the second hole is full, as you can see. I didn't use, you can only put if you want two, two bottles, two quarts, two liters, because I didn't use much of the third bottle. I mean, it's pretty full. I don't know if you can tell by here. basically didn't put maybe I don't know wasn't that much just a little bit so you can just put two of these and that's it don't worry about the third one and make sure to tie them out so it does doesn't spill any oil on your driveway and now it is basically done. Well, my friends, and just like that, we're done replacing the oil and the gasket on this TerraFlex 44. But remember that it's going to be the same process if you have, uh, if you have a Dana 44 or any other 44 axle. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe because we have many more videos like this that maybe can help you. And don't forget to share this video with your friends. And as always, see you in the next one.